Athletics. I am joined by uh, Poonam Beniwal, High Performance Director, Sports Authority of India, and Prem Keshwani, founder uh, IndiaJapanPearls.com, website dedicated to support Indians in Japan. Uh, good evening, a uh, very warm welcome to a special broadcast here for India. Starting with you, Poonam, uh, how strong the Indian boxing contingent is looking this time? As you introduced, it's going to be like uh, strongest uh, contenders from Indian side. And as you see, Vikas and Amit almost they have won in each and every tournament uh, all over the years, uh, uh, recent years. They have won medal in Commonwealth Games, Asian Games, Asian Championships, World Championships. And as far as Mary Robin is concerned, she has won medal in, you know, uh, every tournament of uh, uh, world. Uh, coming on to you, Prem Keshwani, people of Indian origin in Japan are wishing the Indian contingent for their best performance in Tokyo Olympics 2020. What is the atmosphere right now in Japan regarding the Games? Yeah, uh, uh, actually the atmosphere here has, I think, changed uh, instantly once the Indian squad was announced. And it has even uh, further increased once uh, the news about our Indian squad leaving from India yesterday and reaching this morning in Japan. And there has been a lot of buzz about uh, now our athletes are reaching, now they are approaching towards the village. And uh, so there is a lot of excitement around this now here. Uh, India has a wonderful pool of boxers uh, in the Tokyo Games and has a record number of boxers are participating in the Games. In the Rio, the number was three and now it is nine. What are the reasons behind this stupendous success? See, the situation in Rio was quite different uh, to the situation we have got today. Right. Uh, uh, now, coming back to Mr. Prem Keshwani, tell us something about how Indians in Japan are planning to cheer Indian athletes when the Games kick off on July 23rd. Yeah, I think uh, the way uh, Indian community would support here has changed over a period of time here. Uh, as you know, like initially when the games were planned, they were uh, all the spectators were allowed uh, in the stadium. But now slowly that scenario has changed. So I think what will happen is uh, people will support uh, all the athletes definitely from their TVs for sure. But the advantage uh, Indian community here would get because Indian community here uh, resides around 10 kilometers away from uh, where the Olympics are happening. So at least people will go around the stadiums and if they get a glimpse of yes. the uh, players, that would be really great. So, I, and I think the uh, Indian community was involved from day one when the Olympics uh, preparations were started here. Uh, there are around 80,000 volunteers uh, which Olympic committee was kind of enrolling and a lot of Indians also in that and still uh, some of the Indians would be participating in some way or the other. So they would be the luckiest one who would get the glimpse of an athlete or would get an opportunity to at least uh, assist them in person and others who would not be able to be uh, so near to them. I think they will at least try to be uh, near the stadiums. Uh, these are not open stadiums, these are indoor stadiums. The views might be limited. But at least uh, the cheer can be shown when the players are passing in that way. And third, third kind of people would be like anywhere else in the world who would be supporting them through their TVs. I think not attending uh, the matches in person will not uh, reduce excitement. Uh, everyone will be supporting either from their home, outside the stadium, or from the you know, near, nearest possible places. So right there, are, as there are no spectators are allowed, but there is yeah. uh, no dearth of excitement. Is there? Uh, Puna, Absolutely. coming back to you. In the recent past, India has done exceptionally well in sports. How the schemes like tops, sports promotional schemes, and the center of excellence are helping the Indian athletes? Capable of winning medal on the given day. Of yeah. medal this time. Coming back to Mr. Prem Keshwani, how Japan has sealed, scaled back its Olympic plans amid the COVID-19? Yeah, as I briefly uh, talked about it earlier, like uh, when it was a full-fledged uh, Olympics, uh, then there was no plan for any restriction, then uh, COVID happened. And because of COVID, uh, there was a, I mean, they, they had to postpone it for a year, right? And from there also, uh, from today, minus four months, there were still questions around that, will the Olympics would be conducted or not? And I think the decision was finalized only few months back only. So after that was done, uh, then the question arise like, uh, should we allow the spectators or not? Uh, then uh, I think it was on 8th July, a uh, few days back, when they decided they will go uh, without 
uh, spectators in the stadium. And then after that, uh, there was state of emergency declared uh, from July 12th yes, 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 to yes, right. August 22nd. Uh, but uh, mind you, like uh, the emergency yes. here is a kind of a softer form of what we see it in back home. Right. Uh, uh, the restaurants are mostly curtailed and this is more like uh, there were two reasons for it. First, I think the cases for Tokyo uh, were increasing a bit, uh, around touching around 1000 plus. Yesterday we saw around 1400. And second was uh, to avoid uh, a surge during uh, this Olympics. So yes. that was second. And just to add one more here, uh, we will be having here uh, what we call it as Obon yes. holidays, like summer holidays here. And mostly people try to travel here back to their hometowns. So to also to avoid that kind of traveling. So those three reasons were uh, there to have a state of emergency uh, to just kind of keep it. Uh, keep Definitely, the, uh, the, the way Japan has struggled, yeah. but they bounced back and uh, now they yeah. are hosting the games in 2021. Thanks yeah. both of you joining us and uh, giving the Thank valuable you. inputs regarding the Indian boxing contingent and uh, how the situation is there in Japan. Thanks a lot, both of you. Thank you. Now, Thank you. Focus to